must I put up with such questions, even from you? Can I skip? Can I skip? I don't think None I can skip. You. None thinks the Empire is in the right. Trying again with Alexei. The ends don't always justify the means, boss. <laughs> These kids taught me that. Level 50. I could never agree with your way of doing things. A way that is, if you truly... Okay, thank you, thank you, thanks, you do guys. Know that yep, there's did no this guarantee. already. Okay. I didn't place my... Yep, cool. All, All right. Nobody's gonna buy what a... I see my explanations are weak, however. Yeah, right. What? This guy still ha Is he just buying time? Can I skip? It doesn't say I can skip. Oh, God. Ah, uh, yes. Rita Mordio. How very careless of me. I like the face he makes. He's like, oh, right. Oops. Are you serious? And you think you can change the world? Don't make me laugh. How very right you are. Very well. Then. <gasps> you will be the first sacrifice made for the new. Yep, okay, oh, cool. Oh, oh. He doesn't. <laughs> He's also, go. everything is on auto. This Let me just world see if will they can, be they, sh they should be on auto. What's happening? Born, do not interfere. Okay, Nobody there gives you go. A damn about whatever world you want. You're a fool to cross swords with me. Damn, he may be crazy, but he still fights like a commandant. I'll defeat you and punish myself for trusting you. You are foolish to rebel Wait, against your Flynn, destiny. Wait, that's my move. I've what the hell? What is destiny? Move? To fight you. Do you believe your milk toast ideas can bring lasting change to the world? I <laughs> swear to I that that. Would try. Not a single one of you could best me. You've chosen the wrong path. We finish this now. Okay, you're done now? Cool. Oh, oh, Yuri is having so 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 Also, this way you can see more of their moves. And they look really cool. Except for itself. over here right now. Can we get her yet? <laughs> Why am I around a snow? Oh god. I am curious how they handle his ogle in this. Oh, it's down. Brilliant cataclysm! Oh, they're all in it. Did they all die? Okay. Nope, just this Flynn. This is dangerous. <laughs> is everyone okay? Can you please, Flynn? What the hell? Oh my god. <laughs> Why did it take so long? Resurrection! I'm sorry. <laughs> wow. <laughs> they suck with that. And they were never. Yeah, you were never heard from again because he took forever. I don't know why he was taking so long. To even use the thing. I can't skip this event. <laughs> Ugh. Hey, boss. Must I? None of blah, you. Blah, the blah, blah. I could never. If you truly. The guilds and the imp. Using force. You do know that. There's no guarantee. I didn't place if real. All the booty. Nobody's gonna buy. I see my ex, however. Yeah, right. Yes. What? Cool. This guy still. Moving on. Is he, just... he hasn't unlocked everything. Yes, we know. Ah, uh, yes. Are you serious? How very, very well. <laughs> <laughs> You will be the. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He doesn't. <laughs> let's go. Yes, let's this go. This world will oh, God. He'll be reborn. Do not interfere. How do I do it? How do I? Hmm. How do I change it? Thought it was this. Oh God. Eh. 
Nobody gives a damn about whatever world you want. You're a fool to cross swords with me. There it is. <laughs> he may be crazy, but he still fights okay, like a common guy. I'll defeat you and punish myself for trusting you. You are foolish to rebel against your destiny. Oh, I've now you learn it, Flint. That was nice. To fight you. Do you believe your milquetoast Adam. ideas can bring I... lasting change to the world? Damn it. I swore to my friends that we would try. Not a single one of you confessed me. You've chosen the wrong path. We finish this now. Lemon Joe. Here we got him. God, he's coming after me. No. Fly, <laughs> holy sword. I probably am. Wait, did he miss us? Brilliant cataclysm. No. That's annoying. Cool. Um, who's using what? Flynn did really good with that. So, um, sorry, Rita. I'm taking the jail first. <laughs> Definitely a life bottle. Flynn, I got it, because you took forever last time driving me. So I don't trust you. Don't be a <laughs> deliver my enemies and Estelle. Okay. <laughs> Oh. oh, I just realized I don't have any of their good skills on. Damn it. Because <laughs> I was grinding. I don't have any of their good skills on. I don't think I can change it. Ah. <laughs> now they have happiness. Fly, <laughs> sword! Oh, here we go. And Flynn. And Estelle. So where is Rita? She's not over there. Is she honestly uh you first? You alright? Oh. Sorry. Please take care of yourself. Did he just heal? I also don't know where I am with this. There we go. Oh! Not bad. 54. I thought that was his. Yeah, I need to get away from that and uh, 
I'll be over here. Don't come over here. Yeah, you stay over there. Fly, oh holy sword! Damn it! He aimed for me. Oh, but I'm out of that. I thought. I'm okay. Oh no, I was. I was out of it. <laughs> That's good. Hey, Flynn. Use that instead. I will. And cancel that Estelle. How do I cancel that? Oh, whatever. Oh, she canceled it. Never mind. Bring them back from the abyss of death. Try again. Oh, that. Ow, ow. Forgot that was my best. Sorry, if someone just brought him over to your damn way. Yeah, Flynn, get out of there. We're doing real good. Oh, God. Oh, good. He's dazed. Keep her that way, but I'll be over here. Everyone's health is. Oh, God. Yeah! <laughs> I knew. Fly, oh holy sword! Am I in it? I oh, know. Brilliant cataclysm! I think he is getting it. Yeah, he got it. Right. I'm stressing it. Bring them back from the abyss of death. You all right? Sorry. Odin God damn it, Flynn! I keep jumping up and out. I don't want to jump up. I'm trying to do something else, but okay. There we go. Made it work. Oh, damn it. Oh, I don't have enough detail. <laughs> yeah, Rina, I know I tell you to stay away. I don't know. Okay, wow, that was that was quick. I was not ready. <laughs> No! Oh god, Flynn. How do I change the Flynn? Uh, how do I? It takes forever with the life bottle. Pointless. No. Uh. <laughs> how do I change the Flynn real quick? Let me look it up. Deals with Vesperia. Change character in battle. Open the menu by hitting. Let's change. Ah. I just hit this button, I might die. You are not. Okay, good. Jesus. Am I split now? I have an answer for you. Okay, so I'm going to uh make sure I don't die. Sorry. Eventually. Oh, 
Okay, cool. Let's bring Estelle back. Well, nobody got that one. Yeah, Flint definitely went to jail. You better do that first. Oh, God, Arena. Cool. I will use life battle. Battle. Life battle. Alright, Rita. Let me go. Cool. What's happening? How, how you doing, Flynn? Shush! No! Echo, stop! Stop! <laughs> Don't know where that came from. We got 60,000, okay? That's a bit more. I think what would also help is pineapple gel. Yeah, Flynn, you stop. I'm going to use a pineapple gel on me instead. Pineapple gel. Oh god, stay away. Okay, Flynn, now you can use a pineapple gel. <laughs> What in the heck? Oh god. So I'm defending. Does that matter? Oh my god, everyone. <laughs> okay, Estelle, do that. Seems to be a little bit tired. I think that's enough for now. Now the law will give you your due punishment. Face judgment and pay for your crimes, Alexei. Rita had nothing to say. She won the whole thing for us. <laughs> Thank you, Rita. That's the logical outcome. Yes. Are we in the bottom of the ocean still? You. Uh huh. It's over, Alexei. We are really tired. Is this the top of Zaude? Oh, that's right. The platform was raising. We probably shouldn't be here. <laughs> Is that the core? It's so big. Oh, really? Why? <laughs> why they? Why they give her that line? <laughs> you continued the analysis this whole time? We will witness together the might of Zaude. Yay. No! You fool! Um, Yuri? That's not gonna. Flynn! Look out! Oh god! Flynn! Well, your armor doesn't seem to be damaged. Captain! Uh, 
that Dane almost. That's not the sword I had. Get him. Get him like he did everyone else. So the sword turned against me after all. But behold. I don't think you should look away from him. Space. So is Estelle like part alien? <laughs> is that that's what I'm getting from this? She's part alien. Her and Yoda and the whole family. That that what is happening? I don't get it. That reminds me of Lunar Tear, but way bigger <laughs> and more horrifying. Yeah, so what did you do, Alexa? Is that what you wanted? You look shocked. What the hell is that? I don't know, Cthulhu. I've seen that somewhere before. That. It was on the mural. The catastrophe? It's the Autophagos. That is the power of Zaude. No, but I thought... Wow, you messed up big time. This cannot be. Uh... The Anaphagos. Did you use that much air? He, did you look at that thing? No. This catastrophe has always waited there. Did, did you, what do you mean? Did you know about it? The Anaphagos was never eliminated. It was just sealed off far from sight. Yes. The sky. <laughs> and now it has returned to spread the ruin it once rained down upon the ancients. So you did know about it. And to think I caused it all. The ultimate irony. <laughs> Somebody just push him. <laughs> you mean Zauda had been holding it back this entire time? And that's what he meant? Look out! We were never more than worms writhing before an approaching storm. I think the worms would just go underground or something. The time has come, our death draws near. No one can escape its doom. <laughs> so is this what you wanted? Shut up already, you bastard. <laughs> Okay. Oh, that's fine. It seems in the end that I <laughs> was the greatest fool of all. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thanks for that. It, I don't feel bad for you. Oh, it fell. Oh. Not what I thought would happen. I'm sure that he's over there somewhere. The Autophagos disappeared into the void. Yeah, well, guess they didn't really say they destroyed that thing. They just went off and left this piece of crap remnant behind. Uh, Flynn? Yeah, so what the shit? Uh, really? And then she looks like she regrets it? I don't understand. What? Uh, yeah. Can, can somebody explain that to me? <laughs> she better get arrested. You are so happy. And save, huh? Yes? You're so happy to throw my <sighs> butt in jail. She stabs me. <laughs> you better toss her in jail. Better boil her. Throw her remains in the ocean. Let the My room. fish feed on it. 
Why? Oh, Didn't God. think she hated me this much. Oh yeah, she does. <laughs> oh. Ugh. Huh? The child of the full moon. The leaders of the ancients possessed an innate power and were called the children of the full moon. Okay. The shrine of Zaude received their lives and power. It sealed the autophagus away, saving the world. You have awakened. Oh, hi. <laughs> Thanks for saving me. Duke. So it was you who saved me. Why do you know where I live? I couldn't afford to have this sword lost to the sea forever. <laughs> you could have just picked that up, but thanks. Okay. I still owe you my thanks. So the Shrine of Zaude was powered by the lives of the children of the full moon? Humans brought forth the Autophagos and led it. Consider it atonement. Oh, it's sin. The few remaining children of the full moon, together with the Antilochea, decided on how the world would be. The Imperial family are their descendants. So that's how the Empire started. And that's why that sword, the key to Zaude, will prove a true Emperor. As long as air is used, no one can oppose the Autophagos. As long as air is used, no one can oppose. So don't use... Air? For it is born of air itself. You but wanted air is to stop everywhere? the Autophagos, too. That's why you were going around calming all the air crene, right? Correct. Why didn't you ask for help from the Empire or the Guilds? You could have stopped Alexei if you'd done that. I have aligned myself with the Entelikea. I have no intention of coexisting with humanity. I can tell. Look at that hair. That is not humanity-born hair. What's more, the masses of humanity will never come to any accord. I mean, that's true. So, what are you trying to do? The Autophagos was too much, even for that ancient civilization. There is a way. You say you despise humanity, but what about us? Aren't we human? Why did you give me De Nomos? Why did you cooperate? Why did you pull me from the ocean and probably treat my wounds since I'm not bleeding all over my bed? How'd you know where I live? You were the only ones who even attempted to communicate with the Entelechea. That is why. Never mind. It is done. Wait, what are you gonna do? I will protect our world. Our Terka Lumeres. Hold on! Uh, yeah, that stab wound hurts, doesn't Damn it? it? <laughs> hand it over. He just took that shit. You good, Yuri? Is he gonna be limping? Oh god, maybe. Oh, don't run. No. Don't run, Yuri. No one's around. And it's just me. Not even repeat. No. Is that guy over here? Nope, just stuff. Kitty! Oh my god, Kitty! I saw you in Nordopolica. You're the same cat. Huh? <laughs> Repeat! You found me! Oh, what's that? What's that in the sky? Estelle? Repeat? Yuri! A surprise, Repeat is with her. <laughs> Don't do that, he's been stabbed. Ouch, hey, hold on a sec. <laughs> Yuri, it's really you, right? You're not a ghost or something. He's bleeding. Oh. Yeah, I'm living. And yeah, that hurts. Thank goodness. I'm so happy. He's still in pain. Can you heal that stab wound, Repeat please? Repeat just rushed out all of a sudden. I was so surprised. <sighs> Thanks. I'm fine now. Is that wound from when you fell from Zauda? No, a bitch stabbed me. Huh? Oh, yeah. I guess so. Really, Yuri? I can't tell you how happy I am. Sorry to make you worry. 
I want to go tell everyone. They'll be so happy. Except for the one that tried to kill me. What's everybody doing? Rita went to Zauda with Judith. She said there was a lot to study, being ancient ruins and all. That's Rita. Patty's helping out with repairs on the Fiertia, too. Carol and Raven went back to Dongrest. It seems that relations between the Empire and the Guilds are worsening again. Really? Oh, they're still like <laughs> Was that? I out for like a month? Supposedly it's because of Zauda. They went to make sure the Guilds didn't do anything rash. First Heracles, then that. Guild or not, people are gonna be on guard. It's troubling Yoder as well. And Flynn is being Flynn and going off to all corners of the world. Everyone's working hard. Can you tell him that his suborn had stabbed me? They thought they should do what they can, even without you. Yeah. Because we knew. We knew you were alive. Hmm. Even Flynn took ships out to look for you so many times. How long was I gone? I'm so sorry. But thanks to you, I'm all fixed up. You should still rest today. I want revenge. Rita, Carol, they can all wait a little longer to see you. <laughs> As you wish. <laughs> you earned survivor. Yeah, I'm a survivor. Fuck that girl. Seriously? <laughs> uh, does it come with a new outfit? Nope. Estelle, repeat. Sorry to worry you. We were stuck on top of Zauda. We couldn't get down. But Flynn and all the rest of the knights managed to help us. Huh. Sounds like everyone had a pretty rough time. But we're all safe now. All of us. I'm so happy. The air crisis, Duke, the Autophagos. The bitch that stabbed me. We still got me. a mountain of problems to deal with. How about that? Where are we going? Are we going to the... I guess we're going to the castle. I'll just go to the castle. Why not? Look at that. It's so pretty up there. Also, let me see the sky. Yeah, there's that. Was that always there? That line? Like there's something slithering in the sky. <laughs> Alexei unleashed something terrible. Yeah, he did. I'm tired of all this freeing the world nonsense. Just what is the Autophagos? <laughs> A snake. Who knows? A catastrophe. It can't be anything good. Or Cthulhu. It looks more like Cthulhu. <sighs> Guess I get to fight a big one this time. It certainly is. So, you're going after it? It doesn't look like I'll have a normal life if I don't. A normal life. For everyone. That's why we fight. Yeah, that's enough, right? Yes, it is. I thought I heard a familiar voice. <laughs> oh, it's really you. Oh, goodness. I've been in my room. Thanks, everybody. Don't go taking that young lady around everywhere. She must be tired. The one that was stabbed. What do you mean? Estelle, were you using your power? She fixed up every wounded person who came back. We're all in her debt. If there's anything else I can do, please let me know. You see that she does it on her own? Nice yeah, to see the me. lower quarters back to normal. It'd be perfect if only that thing in the sky weren't there. Don't worry. Leave it to brave Vesperia. There you go again. And just how are you going to close up that hole in the sky? We're going to not drive cars as much. <laughs> hey, if anyone can do it, Yuri can. That too. Yeah, he never makes promises he can't keep. That's far enough. Okay. No, you. What do you want? One of you stabbed me, so I don't want to fucking hear it. <laughs> I say, take a look at this. Huh? A warrant? For me? Just Yuri? I say a knight's duty is to apprehend the unlawful. Really? So I'm the only one with a bounty on my head? 
Nobody else? I mean, your head is really pretty. <laughs> That's probably why. That has nothing to do with the matter at hand. <clears throat> we have a proposal. Return to the knights, and this all goes away. No. <laughs> what? Someone high up is making a fuss about leaving you to do as you please. So... Who is making a fuss? You'd feel better putting the reins on me. Is it Flynn? He's now fussing. you've got the idea. <sighs> hey, Swan! What? Where? <laughs> hey, wait! <laughs> so long, everyone. Take care! <laughs> Just as I thought. And I wouldn't have it any other way. Let's go! Arrest that man! Really? <laughs> I'm a victim of you people, okay? This is terrible. I'm a victim of the law. <laughs> of the people that are supposed to uphold the law. They're attacking me and they're arresting this hill's me. Pretty this brutal. is pretty brutal. Bullshit. Those knights are amazing. They are tenacious. Yuri! Patty, where did you come from? <laughs> Whoa, Patty. Where did you come from? Yuri, thank the seven seas. I knew you still alive yep still kicking somehow yeah after I got stabbed by a knight Judith oh I recognize those boots huh hey Judith Estelle I just came to get you where's Rita Rita's an ospio putting together all of her research you'll come too right how long has it been yeah if you don't mind me catching a ride then let's go. Sorry to make you worry, Judy. My heart was about to burst from worrying so much. Yeah, right. <laughs> hey, I really mean it. Wait! Run! Not again. Just once. Just once I want to take it easy when I leave someplace. Run, Yuri. Goodbye, knights. Get back here! <laughs> nope. <laughs> I'm free. And I want my revenge. You know, at first I wasn't comfortable with fighting, but recently I've gotten quite used to it. Oh, yeah? Oh, look at that. Well, you have been fighting a lot, huh? It looks like you're still wasting energy with some unnecessary movements, though. I always try hard to think of what I should do next, but somehow I just can't get things right. Maybe you're thinking too hard? If you fought more on a gut level, your body might respond more fluidly. On a gut level? I see. So I just need to follow my instincts. You think maybe she misunderstood what we were saying? Maybe. But I think she'll figure things out. I thought that's what you meant. <laughs> Don't worry, Estelle. We're both lost. Oh, can I get on this now? It looks like I can. It's red. But it's red. Yep, sorry, Bowl. You're gonna be doing some sit ups. Oh, I can. Ah. And they're still here. Hey, are we still enemies? Yep, yeah, apparently. Cool. I'm gonna just go. So, Alexei's dead, guys. Um, you might wanna pack it up. So, we're going to. Aspio? Aspio. Aspio. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yes, sorry, I know I make you. What in the hell? Ah. That is disturbing. Aspio is somewhere around here, I think. The Autofagos. Seeing the Autofagos just there in the sky, it's horrible. Yeah. To think that catastrophe from the legend was hidden up there all along. It's creepy. It just showed up in the sky out of nowhere. All the people must be so worried. I'd rather see what we're up against than let it grow out of control somewhere hidden away. Your spirit is amazing, Judith. It might be a good thing to have the danger right out in front of us, though. It'll bring together people who'd never get along otherwise. 
But aren't True. they fighting? When you can no longer deny the Autophagos exists, all that's left is to face it. You're right. Yeah, so that happened in Tales of Zestiria, where they all fought a dragon. So good, such a good moment. So are the monsters stronger or anything? What's up guys? Okay, bye. Eureka! Oh, she's up there. Oh, Rita! Yuri is She's <laughs> more invisible to her than a camouflaged cuttlefish. It seems like she's, she's blind busy. to everything but her research right now. I can't really blame the people here for treating her like such a weirdo. She looked so happy. She must have discovered something. I hope so. Let's go and see. Yeah, everyone was like more to yell. Oh, God, no. Ugh. But Rita's awesome, and she's a genius, and I want her on my side, and she is on my side. So, I've won. I don't know what this crystal is about, though. I, I don't know if she grew it or what. Patty's treasure? I'm really glad to see you're still breathing, Yuri. Sorry that I made you look for so long. Well, it wasn't my first treasure hunt, was it? Estelle was the first one who found him, though. Right. So, alas, we were delayed. Are you really treating me like some pretty bobble to be picked up? You're the treasure I've always been looking yeah. for. Oh, now that's true on multiple levels. No special meaning. I mean what I said. Indeed. You are all treasures to me. And now we're off on another treasure hunt? Yes. Exactly. We'll have to be quick and be sure nobody gets to our loot before us. Aye. Rita. I'm alive. Hi. Hmm. We should be able to calculate the force field stability coefficient. So... Rita? We can make a key formula. Efficiency is okay. Making a stable non-dispersing key <laughs> should be... Hey, Rita! What? Don't bother me! Huh? Oh, it's you. How did you get into... Wait, you're... Hi. It, it's coming together. Aww. Where the hell were you? I looked all over for you, you know. Aw, she was so happy. Uh, sorry about that. I got stabbed. <sighs> well, whatever. I don't have time to argue about that. I have something very important to talk to Estelle about. To Estelle? I may have found a way to control the behavior of air. Really? That's great, Rita! I learned lots of things when I investigated Zaude. Like, how we might be able to apply the techniques used there. However, that is related to Estelle's power as a child of the full moon? We need to interact with the air to make it recombine freely according to a formula. This is something only Estelle can do. If only I hadn't given Dane Nomos back. Did you meet Duke? Yeah, he saved me. Yeah, he saved me. Well, he said it was so he could recover the sword. He's a good guy. He's nice. That sword's different from the Child of the Full Moon. I doubt it could be a substitute. But that control formula you used on Estelle, that was to control the power of the Child of the Full Moon, wasn't it? Yeah. So if we're going to control the air with this theory, we have to release the control formula on Estelle. So, if everything goes right, we control the air. But if we screw up, the air will get even worse and the world will fall to the Autophagos. Is that about right? That's quite a bold plan. Aye, it's a plan as bold as jellyfish stuck in shallow waters. I don't know if that's bold. Uh, sure. Let's go with that. Anyway, I'm sure it'll be fine. Estelle, believe me. Lend me your power. <sighs> Are you scared? No, I'm happy. I might still be able to use my power to help others. Rita, Please let me know if there's anything I can do. So what exactly do we need to do? Well, I'm not completely finished working everything out. Give me a little more time. Okay. Okay, we'll go see Carol and Raven while you figure things out. Great! I'll go too. I've got all the materials I need in my head. I'll let you know when I work it all out. All right, Nice! Hearties. Let's go! Let's get going! 
I need... Oh, Judith is here. I don't need Flynn when I have Judith. Although, Flynn, we need to talk. Ooh, if he was safe, the least he could have done is let us know. That idiot. Yeah, if we'd known he was okay, we wouldn't have wasted all this time looking for him. But we wouldn't have known he was alright if we hadn't looked. Which is why he should have let us know in the first place. What? I mean, we looked all over. We'd be too worried about him if we hadn't. You were really worried, weren't you, Rita? What? Thank goodness you're safe, Yuri. Yes, I'm so glad. And just look how happy Rita is. Ha! <laughs> Are you happy? <sighs> yes, she's so happy. If anything, at least punch Flynn, because that is his subordinate. Who really hates him for some reason. I didn't know she had a dagger. That was a dagger she used. Oh god. Uh, it's gonna be... Oh, Cowards! Oh, new music. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Oh, Alright, who's next? You picked the wrong people to fight with. And he's back to doing front flips. Of course he is. He's going to Dongress, which is... Uh... I think this might be a little bit faster this way. Over here somewhere. <laughs> Oh, and that's huh. I mean, if it wasn't the calamity in the sky, it would look really cool. I'm just going to assume that I go over here into the union. And who's running things here since the dawn is gone? Damn it! Why did I have to do it? Okay. That was the dawn's grandson, Harry, right? I can't believe you! You should have told me you were alive! Sorry for worrying you. I sent the text, you didn't get it? But I'm back. Well, aren't you tough? <laughs> That's my boy. Oh, he's so proud. Hey, I said Yuri was my boy first. Okay, whoa. I ain't handing him over to you, Patty, darling. No. <laughs> <sighs> Everybody wants a piece. If you're both done messing around, we just saw Harry. Did something happen to him? Uh, there's been just a teensy bit of trouble. The Union's kind of a ship without a captain right now. So the people won't come together unless there's some kind of core. Core! That's it! What's it? I've got it! Apatheia! It'll work if I use Apatheia! So even if the air stability coefficient keeps changing, if I connect one of those... Hold on, forget the explanation. We wouldn't understand it anyway. Oh, okay. The apatheia we gave to the Dawn should still be around, right? That was Belius' apatheia, the Cyanosiel. Rita's found a way to control air! Really? Cool! Maybe. Maybe not Do you know what it? happened to the Cyanosiel after the Dawn died? Um, nope. What about Harry? Shouldn't he know, being the Don's grandson and all? He's kind of a failure all around, so probably not. Good timing, too. I was just about to take him back. Go to the Union headquarters. We'll be back there soon. Carol, yay, Carol joined the party. <sighs> My favorite person.
Oh goodness. It looks like it smells the atmosphere of is kind of strange. Yeah, the union is falling apart. Because nobody wants to step in to take the Don's place. I wouldn't either. And the Don's heir ain't quite up to it. And how did you get in here? Come on, don't hang back now. I was the one who led Grandpa to his death. Yes. Someone like me could never become a man like the Don was. Ugh. Nobody's saying you got to become a man like the Don was. Teenage angst. We're just saying you should at least show up to the succession meetings. Hey, do you have the Don's epithea? <laughs> We'd appreciate it if you could give it to us. <laughs> Damn, Rita. Straight to the point. Wow, that was quite a fastball, Rita. That apatheia belongs to whoever succeeds the Don. It's not given to outsiders. What? Well, when will they choose a successor? When he gets his shit together. I don't know. Don't ask me. Well then, who should we ask? <laughs> That's a good question. That boy's a real piece of work. Who's gonna protect the city if the Union isn't? What? That would be our guild, of course. Talking Real? of whose guild? I know that you sent in your Clouds of Dawn members to Zod. The Union has Zod never been outstripped by the Empire. We cannot sit here and risk falling behind. Oh, no. I say it was imprudent. It could have been taken as the Union's hostile act against the Empire. In that case, we would defend our honor on the battlefield. He sounds like a grandpa. <laughs> but he doesn't really look like one. And who will be leading the battle? The Clouds of Dawn? He is prototype Buff Santa. If the Dawn got wind of that, he'd burst out laughing. So why don't you boys in Altos throw your hat in the ring? Maybe then we'd see just how unpopular you really are. This is ridiculous. Continue as you please till the world comes to an end. But don't bring up a war between the guilds. This isn't a joke. Hey, I've got a great idea. Let's just set a bit of driftwood in the Dawn's chair. A hard existence being worn down by the waves lends it the exact same air of dignity. Oh, wow. Was that a... Okay. My, how ingenious. <laughs> yeah, you just keep talking. <laughs> that was... <laughs> Damn, Patty. It's all right to be helped by your friends. Protect your friends and they'll respond in kind. Uh -huh. That was the last thing that the Dawn said to me. Carol. What? Who's this kid? <laughs> I can't around. do anything by myself, but I have my friends. Because my friends are there for me, I can do anything. They're still there for me, even now. Why isn't that good enough for the Union? The boy is right. The best thing that the guilds ever had was their ability to help each other. There is always a way to deal with things, even if you aren't some great big leader. The Don told you that from now on, you have to walk with your own feet. You know how to walk on your own feet, don't you? <laughs> okay. Uh, you make it sound so easy, but actually... Let's go. I'm gonna get sick if I have to stay here any longer. Hey, you, wait up! <laughs> oh, Yuri. Miss what you. about the apatheia? Just go take it. If you've got enough spare time to be hanging around those idiots, you'd be better off using it to think of another plan. Another plan? It's not that easy. You'll be able to come up with something if you just don't sleep for three days. Why is it on me? Because you're the genius, and I don't understand half the things you say. Here. Don't throw it. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you giving this to us? No, this is going to be stolen. Cool. What do you mean? I owe you one. Get a move on before the others realize it's gone. To what do we owe this generosity? I don't know. Maybe it just left a bad feeling in my stomach to get lectured by a kid like that. Maybe there's some hope for that boy after all. So, now that we've gotten the Apatheia, what's next? Next up, we're going to the Zophair Rift. Where? I'm going to use the unactivated Air Crenae that's there. The Rift? 
We're going someplace cold again? Mind if old Raven waits here? Yes. You'd rather be cold than have the world be destroyed, wouldn't you? Let's go. <laughs> Yuri ain't got time for shit. <laughs> glad Yuri's safe, men. I'm so glad Yuri's okay. Minus Flynn. Horror! Are you kidding? The Atafagos, the whole world going nuts? There's no way that kid would miss this. You weren't worried, Raven? Eh, maybe just a little. But guys like him keep getting up, no matter what happens, so... Nah, I wasn't too worried. <laughs> you really believe in Yuri, don't you, Raven? Horror! Ah. Uh. You're gonna make this old man blush. No. Yuri, you're everyone's friend, except for the chick that stabbed you, but, you know. Forget her. I can stab her back, though, right? That'd be great. Excuse me, man, you're in my way. I need to... <laughs> I've got this guy. Going to the. They said the. Ooh, that looks so cool. Ah, youth. Look at this. Doesn't all that fighting ocean? ever make you tired, Yuri? Nah, I've got you here to heal me if I get hurt. After all. But getting hurt and getting tired are different. Don't you ever run out of energy? Hmm. I'd say swinging my sword gives me more energy rather than taking it away. You're like an over-energetic kid who runs around until he passes out. Of course, I've got more energy than a kid, so I can make that much more mischief. Ah, Yay! Youth. I'm out of breath with just one swing. I wish I could go back to my younger days. Talk about pathetic. Don't worry. Won't be long before you're in the same boat as me, kid. <laughs> I don't think that's too funny, old man. Well, until then, you can just sit and suffer in admiration of my youthful energy. That's the first time I've ever heard of someone suffering in admiration. <laughs> Also, that's a lie. You are a bitch to beat. Swinging that sword around. Where am I going? I'm just following this thing. I think it's just endless. Is it forever night? Apparently. Alright, it's never ending. Where am I going? I think she said over here. They said in the cold, so it must be this, right? Talking in your sleep. Rita, last night you were saying the strangest things in your sleep. What was it? Come on, tell me! Hey, don't go telling weird stories about me. You were chanting magic spells. So what? That's not scandalous or anything. Shut up! What were you expecting, anyway? Rita, I think all this fighting we've been doing is getting to you. Rita, you were so cute saying spells in your sleep. What are you talking about? But I have to say, I was pretty surprised when the spell actually worked. Oh. Seriously? You see, Rita, you should really get a little more rest. How much of that was true and how much of it was a total lie? Oh, I've never been very good at lies. <laughs> sure. Land, land, land to be like right here. Okay, land me. Land me here. Here? Way over here? Oh, God. So far. Yeah, you don't care. Get out of my way. I can get picked up from here, right? I hope so. Oh, I should have went the other way. Or come... Should have came from the other way. Can I do that? I'll do that. Bowl. You can't pick me up from here. <laughs> Bowl, buddy. <laughs> Okay, right here. 
right here. This way's better. Because it's closer to the Crenne, is it? I'm going the wrong way. In the Dawn's wake. It seems that the Union is still in disarray. They relied on the Dawn for too much. They're probably scared without the guy who used to decide everything for them. I think I know how they feel. Constantly worrying whether or not you're about to make some big mistake. Well, I can't understand being so afraid of messing up that you can't decide anything. Wow, I agree with you for once. The Union has to do a lot of thinking for themselves now that they're without the Dawn. Isn't that how it should be? Absolutely. Oh, no. Oh, God. Eh. We should be fine. It's a cake. Don't get careless. <laughs> the out of fog was in the background. This kills on Oh, guess we're done. Yes, we are done. Only 800 for all that. Oh, it's gold, gold, gold. <laughs> so gold, 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 gold. So, what are you going to do with the air crane? I'm going to use the energy to make an air converter. An air converter? My plan is to efficiently convert the air into matter, decreasing the overall amount of air. But for that, it's ideal to have the converter use energy similar to both air and matter. How is that energy different from air? Elementally separated air transitions into matter in stages and eventually becomes stable. I'm going to stop its transition between the two states and develop a converter formula. Uh -huh. So it won't be air or matter? It's a state that's closer to matter than to air, but it's still not quite matter. Okay. We call it mana. Ooh. Mana. I like mana. To think that one short utterance could hold more gravity than the light used to lure fish out of the frigid sea at night. I have no idea what you're talking about. It actually has a really long, complicated name, but mana's good enough. But it'll still be less stable than actual matter, so we'll need something to act as a core. The Epithea. And a lot of air and Estelle's power to recombine the formula. Using my power without the control formula will unbalance the air. It'll just flood out again. But we can't just sit here and ignore that thing. And... Yeah? It's a bet I'm willing to take. I guess I should be the one trying to stop you, but... I'm game to get in on this bet, too. <laughs> I... I'll wager a billion gold on that. The theory is correct. It'll be okay. I'll return this billion gold to you many times over. Oh, truly now? Oh, wow. Yep. She's in it. Come on. Let's head to the air creme. Yeah, let's get going. Raven's not too happy. I would be unhappy, too. But I would also bundle up. Freezing. I think there's a cabin or something where we get out of the cold. I don't think anyone would build a cabin on top of a sheet of ice. If we just had some fire. Oh yeah, Rita. Use your magic to give us some fire, would you? <laughs> what am I, a walking matchbox? And besides, using it on you would be a waste of air. What's the big deal? Weren't you just using it over and over again just a little while ago? That was to defeat enemies. What would you want me to set on fire anyway? Hmm, you've got a pretty muscular body. Huh? Well, I mean, with the guilds and the knights and all, it's a lot of work. Doesn't look like there's enough fat to burn very well. <laughs> That's too bad. Huh? Hey! I mean, she's saying you're not fat. 
She's also saying she would burn you, but... Main thing, you're not bad. That's the main takeaway. I tell you, thinking of a converter for air, you're quite the thinker. That's our genius mage girl, Rita. Yep, yep. Well, yep, yep, yep. I had a hint to go off of. Come to think of it, you did say you'd investigated Zod, didn't you? Despite its amazing size, it wasn't running off of air. Even though it was a barrier blastia to protect the entire world. A barrier blastia? Well, that makes oh, yeah. sense. They were protecting the world from the Autobots. With how it looked. You mean to say it's been there for a millennium? It's as dogged as a philosophizing anemone. What? Same goes for the Autophagos. It's been clinging to that barrier for just as long. Alexei seemed to believe Zod was a weapon, but he couldn't have been more mistaken. But the runaway air was the cause for the Autophagos awakening, wasn't it? Ah, so that's why they would use a barrier running on power other than air. But then, what sort of power was it using? The children of the full moon, perhaps? It was actually energy taken straight from them. Inside that giant core, it continued to power Zod as a virtually perpetual formula. Most likely, the energy was taken in exchange for their lives. The light of life was extinguished from the children of the full moon. So that's what Miorso's legend meant. According to Duke, they did it of their own free will. They wanted to save the world. The love the children of the full moon bore for this world is what created the barrier. No. Also, why did Duke just kind of leave that book on Yuri's pillow? The power of love makes you want to cry. They sacrificed themselves for the world. The children of the full moon were protecting us the entire time. Secret of Yuri, too. Why did Yuri fall at Zod anyway? The core was falling, so I couldn't see very well. Did he slip? Dear, yeah. What a clumsy lad. After he was stabbed. He wouldn't be able to do much about Alexei. He was pretty hot, so maybe he just wanted to take a refreshing dip. Returning to the embrace of Mother Ocean? That's not like the boy at all. Still, imagining it makes me want to crack up a bit. <laughs> yeah, that's what happened. What's, what is this thing? Why does it look like that? Also, there's a chest in there. And these guys look different. I don't have enough. I don't think I have enough mana. I'ma save first. Hey, Judith is level 51. Read up. Sorry, repeat. <laughs> that monster's not gonna show up again, right? Then we kill it. If it does, you'll beat it up for us just like the last time, right? You're mean. Okay, I'm ready. Estelle, come over here. Now, I'll release the control formula. Once I do that, the air crene will react to you and produce more air. Uh -huh. I want you to recompose the air formula into a stable formula closer to mana. Uh, um, I don't understand. <laughs> exactly, me too. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the water Can element you? is strong here, so imagine flowing water and let your body flow with the air. Like a conductor. The theory behind materializing air is the same as performing magic. If Estelle can recompose the air into a state close to mana, then I should be able to guide the air into the cyanociel. Can we do anything? No. Go take a nap or something. <laughs> We'd freeze to death if we took a nap here. We're pretty handy, you know. We can cook or fish or anything you want. Just tell us what to do. I wouldn't say anything. We can use the conversion formula we found in Zaudet. That was for substituting life for air. Your life! You can't do that! But if this fails, 
then we'll all be swallowed up by a flood of air. We'll be dead anyway, right? We're all risking our lives. Let us help. So, Estelle, don't fuck up, I guess. All right. I'll use your life energy to guide the air into the Cyano CL. If we do that, I think Estelle will understand the flow of the air without interference from me. All right, everyone, let's do this. So dramatic. Oh, yeah. Why not? <laughs> sure, yeah. I guess. Ready, Estelle? Here we go. Everyone, come over here. Go ahead. They took two steps. Try and synchronize yourself with my formula. There, that's good. <sighs> Oh god. <laughs> Air conducted by Rita will flow from left to right on the top line in color. Press the button to correspond. I don't maybe I'm not gonna remember any of this. A B X Y A B X Y A B Y X if the button is not pressed at the correct time, the air will leak, so beware. <laughs> I'm glad I saved. Uh. Okay. Really? So I can't let it. No, that was too soon. What? Uh, I don't know when. I, I don't understand when. <laughs> so it has to touch it. The air is collecting in the cyano cell. The formula is working. The force field is stable. It's gonna be okay. Uh, uh. Is it? What happened? D did it not work? No, it's still under control, but what is this? A formula for reshaping the apatheia. It's reformulating itself! Is it reviving? Hmm. I... don't... Um... Okay. What is that? Uh-huh. Hungry? That voice. Bellius? Judith, yes, it is I, Bellius, or rather, I was once Bellius, but no more. Maybe we shouldn't be using Apatheia. What's going on here? Could the will of Bellius trapped in the Apatheia have... Amazing! I feel the waters of the world at my command. I am the ruler of the waters. That's cool. Okay. So, did it work? <laughs> it's gone way beyond working. I never thought it would gain a will of its own. Nature's mysteries will forever transcend the limited scope of our imagination. Yeah, I'd have to agree with you on this one. Humans, what creature am I? Though no longer Bellius, the Intellicaea, you're a mermaid. You have granted life to me. I ask that you give me a name. A being that controls the essence of a material. Maybe you're a spirit. And so my name shall be... The Splishy Splashy Watercolor Queen! No. <laughs> An ancient word for the ruler of the waters. How about Undine? Undine. Undine. Henceforth, I shall be known as the Spirit Undine. 
Okay, we're just making spirits now. Ah, I feel the power swell within me. Such as the benefit of the air which you saw fit to gather for me. It wasn't any cakewalk either. Receive this now as token of my thanks. Oh, oh nice. What is that? Implied by the name, the sword represents hidden hatred and mankind for itself? Undini, we need to get the world's <laughs> air under control. Please lend us your power. <laughs> Undini? That's not her name. Undine. Very well. However, my powers alone will be insufficient. Huh? I control only the waters. You must gather those who rule the other elements as well. We need earth, fire, and air. The elements of earth, water, wind, and fire. We need at least three more. We'll need help from the other Entelakea, won't we? Pharaoh. There are very few Entelakea left. Pharaoh, Gusios, and Baul. Not Baul. He hasn't taken in enough air to create an apatheia. And on top of that, I won't allow it. I would not suggest Baul. Undine, Did I suggest do you Baul? have any ideas? The shining forest of Arikuru <laughs> and Relawis, the root of the world. <laughs> he called her Undini, and now it's Undine. <laughs> Your friend Baul should know the location of these places. She disappeared! No, she is here. I feel her. It seems like the air crinna has quieted down too, even though we're not controlling Estelle's power. Really? Oh, she's good now? So, Undine is controlling Estelle's power? You mean Estelle is really free? Yes. Yes! That's great, Estelle. Well, things are sure taking a turn for the strange. Yeah, we created a spirit. Is, is that not weird for anyone? Yeah, I never would have dreamed any of this would happen. But we finally see the light at the end. It's a pinprick, but as welcome as the rays of sun. Yeah, I'm, I don't care, Patty. No, no cool clothes for her. Freeing Estelle. <laughs> Rita, you look so happy. happy. So do you, Yuri. There's no longer anything shackling Estelle. She can use her power without causing any harm to herself or unbalancing the air. So yeah, I'm happy. Estelle's really free! There's no guarantee she won't overdo things again, though. We'll just watch her closely. If we don't, she might go back to healing people till she keels over. Yeah. She does that all the time, you know? How do I get out this way, I think? Oh, crap. I don't have time for you. I already spent so much time grinding. Get out of my face. I don't need any of you. Get the hell out of my way. Bitch. Although I am wondering where Flynn is and all of this. Since the whole stabbing thing. Is Undine really here? Yes. I can't really explain it, but she is here. I can sense it. Perhaps she dwells within Estelle. Well, oh, like a... she was created through Estelle. So maybe the two are connected. A seraphim. Very interesting. Okay, is she a shepherd now? What's happening? Hey, save the research for later, okay? I know, I know. You don't have to... W what was that just now? Isn't that where? It came from the direction of Zaude. Oh, what are you doing? Is it Pharaoh? Is it shooting at the... 
Um, it's coming closer. Oh, well, now that's just gone. They are dead. How'd that happen? That looks familiar. The Atafagos. No. Has Zaude stopped working? It looked like somebody just fired something. Uh oh. Do you think we might have done something to set this off? That is the true catastrophe. That thing does look like it could eat the whole world. What yes, are we Katana. supposed to do about something like that? It's a touch too big to fillet with just my kitchen knife. Hey, Rita. Duke said the Autophagos was born from air. Huh? So if the spirits convert air into matter, could we do something about the Autophagos if we had enough spirits? I don't know. I just... I don't know. But I do think it's worth a try. Let's try it, Yuri. Then it's settled. Baul! Yes, I see. Thank you. The Can servants you of the Atafagos are attacking a city, Nordapalaga. <gasps> I guess we can't ignore something like that. Let's go. Yeah, let's save and then go because I am curious. Oh, wait. Hold on. I mean. Ooh! I'm gonna hurt that idiot who brought the Atafagos back! What could have happened at Zaude? Those nut jobs probably fiddled with the thing too much and broke it. Yeah, look like Thanks somebody to Alexei, was just fucking Zaude's around. no longer functioning like it was meant to. Greed always eats itself. That wouldn't be a problem if there weren't other victims. This guy just never learns, does he? Well, Things are gonna have to hit dead. bottom before he consider changing his ways. He, but they see that thing him. about to eat the planet, right? Even an idiot would understand the situation. I sure hope so. I think they're just slower than idiots then. Yay, excuse me, pardon me, look out. I got a game to save. Save. Now the sky looks real cool. To where uh the, the Nordapolica which uh... Yep, that's about right. I Yeah, what's that? <laughs> What is that? Yeah, let's just go park right, right in here. It looks like a manta ray. It's not letting me. Oh, what's would it actually go to the beast? Oh, man. Is there like a beach over here? Nope. Okay, bowl. 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 Uh, I didn't restock on all my items. Really? We will not go easy on you. Does it look like we have time for this? That was too short. It was short enough, whatever. But let's go to this thing. Look! It's hanging on to the city! That black thing. That's what we saw on the sands of Kogor. That was Pharaoh's vision. This is real. Be careful. It looks like it's trying to eat the air of the shield. Is the Atafagos drawn to air? This thing looks pretty mean. I can't Maybe, see what they're looking but at. It's what we've caught on our line. We'll reel it right in. Come on. Can I see what you're looking at? I want to see it. I want to see it eating the shield. Huh. 
Daybreaker. 52. Oh. Okay, well that was quick. Did it multiply? Wow. Nightbreaker. Nightbreaker's for me. Daybreaker. Physical hits aren't working, it seems. So I'll just be over here. What is happening over there? What is happening over there, guys? No good. I can't see. I can't see. There we go. Stop jumping, Yuri. I swear. All right, let's go check it out. Yeah, it wasn't that I bad. I can do even better than this. I'm even stronger now. That wasn't too bad. <laughs> nothing against Alexei. Or nothing like Alexei. Oh, they're still there. Hold that guy, position. oh god. We're gonna stop them here. No need. Things getting wild around here. Y you were. Yes, I'm Yuri. What's up? I guess I'm saved again. It seems that this was the only city to be attacked. What bad luck. They are really close to Zalde. That's probably why. This isn't about luck. Where were you, Rita? I went to check the barrier Blastia. Its power had been raised. 
And I guess the monsters were drawn to it. The power is returned to normal now. We thought raising yeah. the power would protect us, but it turned out to be the opposite. I'll go see the citizens. Feel free to rest here as long as you please. Sweet. Thanks for the offer. For but free? we still have business to do. We better get moving. You are all welcome at any time. Try stopping by when you have the time. Thanks. Yeah, we'll do that during the the calamity. <laughs> the end of the world, you know. Ew! I can't believe the Autofagos could spawn such a disgusting monster! <laughs> the illusion Pharaoh showed us. He was trying to make us feel the power of the Autofagos. But it's no illusion this time. Oh man, are hordes of these things just gonna attack everything? <laughs> Ow! Hey, no fighting! <laughs> It's all right, Rapide. He's just a little nervous, that's all. And what's wrong with being a little nervous? I'm not gonna run away or anything, I swear! Yeah, Rapide will get you if you do that. The door is locked, I can't go in. I thought I could rest here. Lies. I can't get in the warehouse. Everyone freaking out. They're always freaking out. What about you? You're always sweating. I tried being patty. What about now? Hey. Small blonde braids in her hair. Okay. <laughs> Outside, blah blah blah. Not traveling, or yes, traveling, but not for a good reason <laughs> to save the world, you know. It's not for fun or vacation, it's for I. What's a miracle gel? Oh, well, give me those. <laughs> I'll take 15 of these too. Life bottles, holy bottles. Stock up on everything. I will need all of this. Nats was really working hard. Yeah, it looks like he's doing a good job leading since Belly has passed away. I'd like him to meet Undine. He'd be so happy. Not right now. I think that'd be a little bit weird. Once everything's settled down, though. Oh, look at that Let's statue. give him a nice surprise. Okay. That monster. Paul Australia was no match for it. I can't figure it out. So how did we take it out? Maybe there's something different about us. The spirits, perhaps? If the Autophagos really is close to air, then the spirits might actually affect it. So can we put up more of a fight if we get the other three? Who knows? The four elements alone could control air. But we're talking about the Autophagos. I just don't know. Yeah, and it's not like you can find Apathea lying around just anywhere. There aren't many Entelakea left, either. Hey, there are tons of Blasty all over the world, right? Yes. They're an indispensable part of our society. Yeah, so let's destroy them. And cores are just pieces of Apathea. So if the four spirits aren't enough, we can just change all the cores of the world into spirits, too, right? Hmm. Then we may end up with as many spirits as there are grains of sand. Are you nuts? How do you propose to do that? Even if we knew how, we'd still have to go to every single Blastia. I doubt the Autophagos would wait for us. I think that's your specialty, genius. Oh no! This is your genius plan! Even it's, if it's Yuri's a, plan my worked... Idea. <laughs> it's not a plan, All the Blastia would it. stop working, wouldn't they? Yeah, I guess so. All the cores would be gone. What would the world become? People would lose the safety promised by the barriers. All the functions that the Blastia maintained, gone. It'll be inconvenient, to say the least. Even Bodhi Blastia wouldn't work. Who cares? Blastia or no Blastia, a single ore is all I need to cross the ocean. I admire your spirit, Patty. 
Well, isn't that all fine and dandy? But even that won't work. There'll be a it? lot of unhappy people, but we have to do it. Otherwise, the world will fall to the Autophagos, even if no one else ever understands why. Well, for now, let's just get the four elemental spirits. And then we'll figure it out from there. those other bridges when we come to them. Baul knows where the other Antelikea are, right? Yeah. Let's get back to the ship and ask him. Is it where those pointy rocks are? Can you stop swinging that sword like that? Good grief. So cute. Can we take a cat? <laughs> what a cat. The shining forest of Area Lumen and the root of the world, Reloise. Where? I've never heard of those places. If only we could glimpse them. Would make things far easier. <sighs> Baul says he knows. However, hmm? he doesn't want to tell us. Apatheas only come from the death of Intelikea. He doesn't want to put his friends in danger. Baul, listen. We want to protect the world, but we don't want to sacrifice anyone for it. We won't just take the Apathea by force. <laughs> we'll ask kindly. Baul, please. Tell us where the Intelikea are. I mean, I have an idea. Area Lumen is in the northeast part of Tolvikia. Reloise is... on the continent of Wakea. Thank you, Baul. We also need to go to the sands of Kogor, where Pharaoh is. Right. <laughs> Let's just ask Tulbikia. him kindly. I wonder if that's the place where a new land just recently crystallized. Northeast Hill. Where's Tolvikia? Wakea is that continent to the south of Ilikia, where the capital is, right? I don't even know. Wakea. The Emperor Calx III sent scouting parties four times in order to claim the land, but every time they lost communication and no one ever returned. It's the last unexplored land on Terkalumares. Is it that rocky place? Why does it Not have to be a place, place like that? Kind of, it looks kind of like a desert canyon, if but Wakea is that islands. bad. Then let's leave Reloise for last. I mean, I was there, if it's what that is. He says he'll leave things up to you. Thanks, Baul. Let's go. You're good people, Baul. We can't exactly dawdle forever. We can. We can dawdle for as long as we want. Oh, it's that thing. Anyway, this thing? Are they talking about this over here? <laughs> this area? Because that was grinding in this area. There is a place to explore. I think it's this. Never went in. But I'm guessing it's this. Yeah, it is. So this is Reloise? Yes. Well, why? Yes, Baul, yes, Baul, says, Baul says, it is. says it is. Is that supposed to be echoing? But, but I don't see I don't any air crane or Antelikea. Looks like we can take this path down. It's a long it's a way long down. Way down. <laughs> Don't fall. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Now that is a sight to behold. Please be careful not to fall, Patty. Carol's the one you ought to be worrying about taking a tumble here. Th that's not true. Let's get going. Let's get going. Yes, yes, it looks like that's, that's all we can, all do. can do. 
Hey, why don't we just why ride Baloo all, all the way to the bottom? To the bottom? No, no, it's narrow, it's narrow and the wind is all over the place. the place. It's a little too, a little dangerous. too dangerous. This wind is fierce indeed. This place must be where all the gales are born. That means that this wind. valley is the mother of the wind. The mother of the wind, huh? I can see a can river see a way river down at the bottom. bottom. This is what this happens, what when, happens a when a river wears away at the earth, earth for earth years and years. Ah, the power of nature. Who knows how long it took to make this? Millions of years. Whoa! Whoa. I get all dizzy, get all dizzy when I look dizzy straight, when down. straight down. Idiot. Idiot. <laughs> well, just make sure just you make don't sure slip, you and fall. slip and fall. Ugh. Moron. I'm curious. Oh. How hard are these guys? Eh. Eh. Okay. I'll take him out! Our strategy worked! Yeah, it did. 57. <laughs> oh, maybe not. Maybe not here yet. Oh, sorry. I'm at wrong one, but whatever. <laughs> oh, nice moves. Oh, baby, how's this? I will fight until we crush the menace. That's not too bad. What's in here? Damn it. Sorry, but you're going bye bye. Seriously, another freaking mimic. <laughs> The sign of victory. Okay. Eight hundred isn't bad. Ooh, a staff. How are you with your equipment, Judith? Anything else you need to learn? Just a staff? There you go. Oh, and then Estelle got something of hatred, <laughs> which doesn't really go with her. Where did that go? Yeah, Dark Avenger. <laughs> sure. <laughs> go for it. But I'm gonna cut it here. Got pretty far. Yuri got stabbed. I'm mad about that. If Do something about it. Oh, it tells you where you are over there in the corner. Good. First time noticing that. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you all tomorrow for more tales.